Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another video from Ling Ling. Today I am in a beautiful setting here in Hangzhou and I thought why not shoot some really cool videos for you guys while I am traveling around. Yay! Uh, I forgot my tripod so that was dumb but now the camera is standing on my back on top of a little bench and I hope it's okay. And the front here I don't really know what that is called but but yeah, I still thought the setting was really cool. Anyway, so today is yet another language video, Chinese language. Oh my God, it keeps surprising me over and over again. There are so many different things to talk about. Today we're going to talk about a uh, very interesting internet uh, slang, which is called meng meng da. Yeah, that's cute, right? <laughs> Meng means cute and meng meng is like a way to emphasize the emphasize the meaning of the word so even cuter meng meng and da is just like an extra particle in the back <laughs> so it's just even more cute like meng meng da mm. so cute right uh, it originates from Japanese manga but I'm not sure how that's just what I read somewhere online um, but apart from that people use it to uh, show how cute they are or their friends are it's a really fun way to write on your um, when you're online when you're posting pictures selfies of course and then you can write in the end oh I'm so cute I'm so mumunda so that is another internet slang here in China right now it's a very popular one another term that's widely popular online especially for girls to write is mumunda so it's kind of the same thing. M is just like mwah, you know, like the kissing sound. So mwah mwah da. Wow, weird. Anyways, <laughs> um, so people write that online like mwah mwah da, mwah mwah. It's it's like the sound. So this is another way of being really lovable and cute and like sending hearts and kiss and hugs to your friends and family. And. Really? So, meng meng da, cute, and meng meng da like mwah, um, kind of leads me to today's uh, discussion. Uh, I'm trying to explain what I think, but it's really difficult. So, before I wrote an article about this, the fact that when I'm in China, it's like cute is the beauty standard for girls, whereas abroad, it's kind of like sexy, you know. So here a boy would say, oh, you're so cute. And I'll be like, oh, so happy, you know. And I have those cute covers uh, for my phone, the phone cases. And I would never have that in Denmark. And then like how you dress and how you behave here, it's just like, mm, I'm so cute, you know, speaking with this very cute little girl voice in Chinese. Whereas abroad, I would go more for sexy if I'm like, you know, flirting with a guy. Um, it's just a really interesting difference. I don't know if you have any experience like this. Uh, if you have been in China uh, or Asia in general, I feel like it's Asia a lot. Like, oh, I'm so cute. And boys are like, oh my God, she's so cute. And I'm like, before when somebody said I was cute, I'd be like, ew, why would I want to be cute? Like nobody wants to be cute, but apparently here it's, it's very normal. And I also got more used to being cute and I don't mind it anymore. Um, yeah, I don't know. I just feel like the beauty standards are different here. I don't know. Please uh, let me know. I Oh gosh, it's such a confusing thing because I don't exactly know what I think. I don't exactly know how to explain it to you guys. But I hope you kind of get the idea of where I'm going. Um, so anyways, please let me know about your opinion on this topic, this meng meng, uh, cutie cutie pie. And uh, yeah, apart from that, I'm just gonna leave it there. But I just really wanna discuss these uh, beauty standards uh, from the West to here here China here anyways uh, I hope you enjoyed this little video I hope you can use the terms um, if you don't understand the discussion question that's totally fine I get it I will link uh, I would put a link to my um, article about down below to my website so you can read it maybe it makes more sense if you read it uh, anyways I hope you're having a great day evening wherever you are in the world and uh, I'll see you again very very soon Ling Ling is out see ya and Sai Jian Mwah. Bye bye. <laughs> ah, mung mung da. Mwah. <laughs> da. <laughs>